Welcome back. Time to imagine it. Carl Nelson's here to imagine all kinds of stuff for us. He has uh, flames ready. And, exactly. And noise. And uh, how, how? What are we doing here? <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna make sound okay. with flame. Gotcha. Of sorts, okay. So I brought with me a couple different pipes, uh, just aluminum pipes, and inside I have wedged in some of these little metal screens. All right. Okay. And we've got two blow torches here. What we're going to do is we're going to heat the screens up until they are glowing red hot. All right. And so with your ungloved hand, okay. don't touch the red hot. Don't touch the red hot thing. Put your hand <laughs> over it. Good advice. You very feel hot. It? Very hot. Yes. Very hot. Hot air rising off of that. We're going to use that with our pipes. Okay. So you got your glove on. Got Excellent. the glove. Grab your torch there. Got the torch. And inside here. You can see there's a little screen. All right. All right. And we're going to just uh, heat those up until they're glowing red hot. All right. All right. Just keep going, keep going, keep going. It looks like it's hot. All right. That looks pretty good. Now go ahead and turn the torch off. Turn the pipe up. Oh, no, no. And hold it right there for and a hold second. It. Whoa. Hey. Whoa. All right. Hey. So yours probably isn't quite hot enough. Go ahead and blast it again. I'll blast it. Really, really hot. You want that thing to be sets. glowing red hot. This is only a test, everyone. Pull your torch back a little bit. Perfect. All right, now go ahead and turn your pipe upright. Hold Carl it. plays with fire more than I do. <laughs> wow. It's, mm. it's, it's, it's coming, it's coming. Don't move it, though. Oh, there you go, lower. Tip it, tip it sideways. When it's sideways, the hot air can't rise, and mm -hmm. it can't sort of excite the pipe. But when you turn it upright, the hot air will rise, and you get that sort Wild. of sound coming out. Wild. Okay. And so we'll do this one more time. Heat, okay. your, heat your pipe up. You're getting lots of practice here. Excellent. Now we've got two pipes that are identical in length. Okay, so they're both the same size. We should get like double the sound, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> so let's double go ahead and give that sound. a try. Tune. They're a little bit out of tune. They're not exactly <laughs> the same length. So you get that beat frequency. Sure. Which, um, of course, the fun thing you can do with this, it's not really science, but I can. Okay. Do yeah. you, see, you see the sound? Yeah. See it? No, you don't see it. Right? But, <laughs> but I can pour it back into the pipe. Oh. How did he do that? <laughs> I hate to do that. I hate to do that. That's not like really science there, but. That's okay. Um, That's like when Scooby Doo would bark into a bag and they would open it later. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, so, hey, you've got a lot of stuff going on at the Imagination Station this week. Sid the Science Kid's a rock star in my house. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Sid the Science Kid will be in. You can visit with him. And then all this coming week, we have Little Scientist Week, which um, is all about kindergarten and under. Yeah, I think it's cooled off now, so you're not going to get anything out of that. <laughs> All this week, Little Scientist Week, so we got cool activities for kids kindergarten and under, and um, we don't book school groups for large kids for right. this week, so we keep it for the little ones, gotcha. so it's a lot of fun. Carl Nelson, and remember, don't play with fire at home, kids. That's right, <laughs> don't try go. this at home. <laughs> Let's turn it over to Dave and Sports.